this is Tex from Soft Serve Parts again. In today's video, I'm going to talk to you about thermistor probes and Taylor Soft Serve machines. I'll show you how to check a thermistor probe using your ohm meter or multimeter. But first, let's talk about what thermistor probes do. Thermistor probes sense the temperature of product in either the mix hopper or the freezing cylinders. And when they go bad, the machine can't sense the temperature in the mix hopper or the freezing cylinders and therefore can't regulate those temperatures. The hopper probe senses product temperature whenever there is product in the machine whereas the left and right standby probes or barrel probes only come into play when the machine is in standby mode. If your machine's not maintaining safe food temperatures in the hopper or either freezing cylinder and adjusting the machine won't work, there's a good chance you have a failed thermistor probe. We check a thermistor probe by measuring its resistance. So on my meter, I'm going to set my meter to ohms. If you have a selectable multimeter, it needs to be set to 1k ohms. You can start by removing the, uh, the leads to the probe. It should be a black and a white wire. The colors really don't matter. One wire goes to the logic board, the other connects to a ground. We're going to disconnect those and connect our, the leads to our meter. need to have a good connection there or else your meter could read OL. If you have a bad probe, your probe might also read OL or open. We have our leads connected. Turn my meter to ohms. And it looks like we're measuring about 10.77, 10.78. Looks like it's settling at about 10.77. So we'll make note of that. The 10.77 ohms or 10.77 K ohms that we measured corresponds to a temperature on the thermistor curve chart you see here. As you can see the reading I got corresponds to 73 degrees or 74 degrees on the thermistor curve chart. Since the machine is sitting in my office at room temperature and I know the room temperature is about 73 degrees we know that this pre probe is reading correctly. If you get a reading like mine and your machine is sitting at room temperature, your probe is probably okay. Most likely you're testing this probe with ice cream in your machine, either in standby or you can test the probe in auto even though it doesn't come into play. You can still test your probe in auto mode. So the way you would do that is you would take your ohm reading and go to the chart and look for the corresponding temperature. Um, most likely, if your machine's in auto, your product should be between 17 and 22 degrees Fahrenheit. So that would correspond to somewhere between 43 and 50 K ohms. If the reading you get is off by more than 5 degrees, or if you get an OL reading or an open reading when you take your ohm reading, then it's probably time to replace the thermistor probe. Go to www.softserveparts.com to order a new thermistor probe or any parts for your Taylor soft serve machines. Hope you found this video helpful. Thanks.